If you own a Windows Mixed Reality headset and you're considering to upgrade your computer to the latest April update of the Windows 10 operating system, you might want to reconsider because the April update introduces an unfortunate controller bug that might break your VR experience depending on your play space. All the details coming up. Hi and welcome here to MRTV. My name is Sebastian Ang and if this is your first time here and you're just as excited about VR and AR as I am, then subscribe now and click on the bell button so you don't miss anything. So I was really excited to upgrade my computer to the latest April update because it does introduce some new features for our Windows Mixed Reality headsets. And well, one of these features is that there is now rumble and forced feedback in the Steam VR games, which before was not available. So that part is good. Also, we have that beautiful new environment, the Skyloft, and indeed it is really nice. However, unfortunately, there's also a big bug that was introduced with the latest version of the Microsoft operating system. And that bug has not been fixed until now. So I hope that with this video, we can kind of point the attention to that bug so Microsoft can fix it. So this bug was first reported by our beloved community member, Hemi, William Hemi Hemmingson. And he found out that in Steam VR games, if, if you come close to your, to your boundary, with your controller and if you go through that boundary with your controller, the controller will um, activate the menu button without you pressing it. So for example, in Skyrim, if you get close to the boundary, then the menu will pop up or if you're playing a uh, rec room and if you get closer to your boundary, then you will um, drop your weapon, which of course completely breaks your immersion and yeah, it might make you lose the game, right, Hemi? Like we lost when we played Rec Room together last Saturday. So this is a very, very unfortunate bug. And well, if you can reproduce, reproduce this bug, then please follow the link that I've posted in the description below. It's a link to the um, feedback hub where I reported that bug to Microsoft. And if you could upvote that bug, if you can reproduce it, then for sure Microsoft will yeah, work harder on that problem. So please do check it out. Can you reproduce it? Please fire up Skyrim or please fire up Rec Room and simply use your controller and go close to the boundary and put your controller through the boundary and see what happens. So this is really unfortunate. If you have this problem, well, you can kind of fix it directly by simply deactivating your boundary, but this kind of problem shouldn't appear in the first place. Also, on top of that, sometimes, even if you're not close to the boundary, the controller will simply disappear. So me and Hemi also had this problem. We were playing um, Beat Saber and trying to beat each other's scores, but then sometimes, out of no reason, the controller will simply be gone. So that is really unfortunate because now really all the Windows Mixed Reality players will be at disadvantage to compete for that high scores. And yeah, that's probably the reason why you won't see MRTV Sebastian there <laughs> on top of those high scores. So yeah, these are like two big problems that we're facing right now. And if you have a Windows Mixed Reality headset and you're considering to upgrade to the April update, probably, probably you should wait because, well, it is indeed a problem right now. Even for me personally, I have even some more problems where my whole horizon is tilted by 30 degrees. So at the moment, it's really nearly impossible for me to play. But it seems like I'm the only person who has this problem right now. If you also have that problem, please also let me know in the description below and then we can see if uh, yeah Microsoft can do something about it. For me, I have to reboot, reboot several times now and then it will probably sometimes work. But at the moment, the April update kind of breaks the Windows Mixed Reality experience, at least for me. So please, again, if you have the same problem with the controller getting close to the border and triggering some keys, please do follow the link in the description below to the community feed. feed um, feedback and upvote it so Microsoft will fix that bug. Yeah, that's it for this short 
service announcement. Um, yeah, if, you, if this was helpful, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any more questions or comments, please do leave them in the comment section below or much better if you directly want to chat with me or Hemi or anybody from the great MRTV community, check out the MRTV Discord server. The MRTV Discord server is a great free resource where you can chat with me and the community. And well, there's never a dull moment. It's fantastic. You can go there free of charge. Simply follow the link in the description below and meet me there. All right, that's it for this video. If it was helpful for you, give it a thumbs up. And of course, if you have not yet subscribed to MRTV, please do that now. I'm looking forward to see you in the next episode.